What's up YouTube? It's Makuno1 here with my most recent Chaos Dragon Gallus Monster Mash build because someone asked for it because I'm a nice guy like that. Uh, I would probably make a couple of tweaks to this but I need to test it some more. So if you net deck it and fail horribly, it's not my fault. But yeah, let's just jump straight into it. Play the one red MD. Triple Light Pulsar and one Eclipse. I don't run Dark Armed um, just because with this deck you just want to get everything into the grave as soon as possible. You don't want to keep it hovering around three. That's my justification for only wanting one Eclipse Wyvern as well. Yeah. So the standard five dragons. I then play two Cephalon. That's the amazing card. Ten monsters in grave, just drop it. Really quite easy to do in this deck. Uh, another easily droppable boss monster is Light Ray Daedalus, which I play three of. You just need four lights in the grave. And that's pretty easy to do if you manage to open up some light swans or card troopers or anything. Uh, you probably won't get its effect of unless you're playing against like Dark World or Prophecy or GKs or something. But if you are, this is it's a great help. It's just an easily droppable 2 6 beat stick in most situations. Also makes a really quite easy big eye. I then play one BLS, obviously. It's a chaos deck, you got to run it. Uh, one Jane. To Lila, siding a third. Triple Raikou, because it punches a hole in everything. Absolutely amazing. Double Veiler. Need hand traps, because you run no back row at all. Or at least I don't. Uh, one Honest. And two Ryo, to round off the lights. Play as many light swans as you want. Uh, like you can play Erin's and Garoths if you want to go even more light swan and run JDs over uh, Daedalus. Perfectly possible. I just kind of chose not to do it. Uh, for the darks, I play one Chaos Sorcerer, one Gores, two Trigodia, three Battle Fader. I'm running these over Necro Gardener because whenever I tested Necro Gardener. I was always used to draw it and it was dead and it was horrible. It was bad times. Carrying on, I play two tour guide, one knight assailant, and one sangan. Kind of fairly standard. Um, I've seen knight assailant go sort of a bit out of favour, but it's just the fact you can send this and a light for like pulsar to the, to the graveyard. And then get back a Raikou. It's quite good. And obviously it just pops stuff as well if you send it. Uh, then play Triple Birdman for the Gallus shenanigans. It's also just a really nice tuner. Sort of in general. And that's the Darks. For the rest of the stuff, I play two Card Trooper. It mills its 1900 under its effect, and when they kill it, you draw a card. Absolutely amazing. Obviously, if it was at 3, I'd run 3. And then I'd run 3 Gallus. Just mill, burn, and a summon, which is pretty good. And obviously, you mill like a Cephalon or a Trag, you're doing 2k, which is nothing to be sniffed at. And that's the main deck. I think it's 41 cards. I'm not sure. I don't think I've counted this one. But it's 40 or 41. For the extra, we play Acid Golem, Zen Mines, Leviathan, Giga Brilliant, and Levier for the rank 3s. I uh, really want to make room for, some tem for a Tem Tempo, but I don't want to cut at the moment. 
while you play one rank four in the form of Queen Dragon Jin. So you can get back your light pulsar and then when it dies you get the loopy shenanigans going. So run strike bounds or next beetle, V sixes. And one big eye for a seven. For Synchros, I play Catasta, Orient, Black Rose Dragon, Stardust Dragon, Scrap Dragon, and one Mistworm. This is prob uh, I think Mistworm and Catasta are probably the two most um, uh, sonable Synchros in, in the deck. Um, closely followed by Orient, but you don't really want to go into Orient that much. Unless they've got something big like a Stardust staring in the face. But yeah, uh, let me know what you guys think of this deck, any tweaks you'd make. As soon as I get some solar recharges, I'll try that sort of variant. Um, some of the more traditional Chaos Dragons as opposed to Gallus. But eBay seems to value them about 20, 10 quid each at the moment. And seriously, screw that, I'm not paying that. But yeah, this is Mercury 1, signing out.